I said LeBron James was one of the greatest players of all time. Top five, in my opinion. Also, I said I respected LeBron James for what he does off the court probably more than any other player that ever played in the NBA, including Michael Jordan, for, for political reasons. Uh, for one, Michael Jordan, he never spoke about the president. He never spoke about... Uh, racism, things of that sort, because he didn't want them to affect the sales of Jordans. Hey, he's a billionaire right now. But the link for this video will be in the description. LeBron James tears into NFL owners. He says they're old white men with slave mentality. NBA star LeBron James said that in the NFL, they got a bunch of old white men owning teams, and they got that slave mentality. And it's like, this is my team, you do what the fuck I tell y'all to do, or we get rid of y'all. James contrasted the way in which NBA Commissioner Adam Silver allowed basketball stars to politically express themselves on the court to the NFL's attempt to stop players who take a knee during the national anthem before games and protests of police brutality and systemic racial injustice. It doesn't even matter if Adam agrees with what we're saying, James said. He at least wants to hear us out. As long as we are doing it in a very educational, nonviolent way, then he's absolutely okay with it. Because at the end of the day, it's the players that make the ship go. In October 2017, when he was still with the Cleveland Cavaliers, James wore footwear emblazoned with the word equality during the season opener against the Boston Celtics and reportedly solidarity with the NFL protest sparks by former 49ers quarterback Colin Kaepernick. Facing a barrage of criticism from conservatives, including Donald Trump, players had to stand during the national anthem on the field. James also highlighted what he claimed was another way in which the NBA and the NFL treated its athletes in this clip. The difference between the NBA and the NFL, the NBA cares about what we believe can be the potential, he said. And the NFL is what can you do for me this Sunday or this Monday or this Thursday and if we ain't it, we're moving on. So, hey, man, I, I totally agree with what LeBron James said. It's it's crazy how um, you don't have a freedom of speech when it comes to a lot of sports and the entertainment business in general. You can't say what you want to say because it'll tarnish their image more than it would yours. Like this video, leave your comments, share it on social media, subscribe.